I'm leaving for school now, Mother. In my absence, I expect my clothes washed, ironed, and pressed. My room cleaned, saliva bathed. My socks color-coordinated. My goth metal posters framed. The house remodeled. The toilet spit-shined. My room painted black. My knives polished. And my secret mutant army released into the streets of Ensville. All done by hand. Yes, dear. Whatever you want. That's better. Farewell, parents. D do you think our call got through? Let's hope it did, dear. <laughs> oh, pardon me, would you by chance be the parents of a Miss Mandy? What a day at school! Why didn't you tell me I forgot to wear pants? It was picture day. Hello, Mandy. I've been waiting for you. I suppose you know who I am. I suppose you know that I don't give a... Wait a second. I know who that is. She's, she's that one fat lady with the frizzy hair and beady eyes and... I think her name's Paul or something. Hold on. She's the nanny. Yeah, she's on that television show, Hey Nanny Nanny. It's another one of those annoying reality shows that are all the rage right now. She travels all over the world. And Burbank. Helping parents deal with their spoiled, rotten brats. So what's she doing here? <laughs> spoiled brat, huh? Lady, I don't care who you are. No one is going to tell me what I can or can't do. Especially not some imported babysitter with bad teeth who smells like greasy armpit sweat. <laughs> Young lady! My greasy armpit sweat is a serious problem, so I'd appreciate it if you didn't make fun of it. Besides, your parents called me personally to ask for my help. <laughs> I knew they had something to do with this.